Hello and welcome. I'm Peter Lindstrom with the Clean Energy Resource Teams, and I'm going to talk to you for a minute about the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program. First, CERTs, the Clean Energy Resource Teams. We connect individuals and their communities to effective resources for planning and implementing local energy projects. So if you're a city or a county or a school, I suspect these challenges look pretty familiar to you. You have limited funds and time. You've got a lot of upgrades you need on your facilities. You have a lot of deferred maintenance, space constraints, high energy costs, and high operational costs. GESP, or the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program, aims to address these challenges. It addresses these challenges through a tool called performance contracting. Performance contracting has been around for several decades. And on a high level, uh, performance contracting, sometimes called energy savings performance contracts, is a simple concept. Savings uh, come from building energy upgrades, and those upgrades or those savings are used to pay for projects. So here on the left, we have a pie chart. Uh, your utility spend before improvements are made. You have your energy costs and a smaller slice, your maintenance costs. After the improvements are completed, the pie chart is still the same. You've made these energy efficiency improvements, so you have lower energy costs. You have less maintenance costs because you now have new energy efficient equipment, and the savings help repay the work that has just been completed. Some things to consider when you're thinking about utilizing the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program. Maybe upgrading to high efficiency boilers and chillers, converting to ground source heating and cooling, retrofitting to efficient lighting, installing heat recovery equipment, redesigning your HVAC system, adding solar energy systems, and increasing water conservation. To be considered for the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program, first of all, you have to be a uh, local uh, publicly owned building for a local government or school. Uh, it helps to bundle projects together, and uh, those uh, generally have to be uh, at a minimum project value of approximately a million dollars, and the potential to save a minimum of approximately 20% of your annual utility budget. Some of the key drivers of the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program include organizational goals of reducing your energy use and reducing your greenhouse gas emissions, utilizing renewable energy and creating jobs in your community. You may have facility issues. There may be occupant comfort issues or health and safety issues. You have deferred maintenance that needs to be addressed. And there's always the issue of energy price uncertainty. You may also have resource needs around your budget and your manpower and capacity to address these issues. So the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program, this is a bit of a busy chart, but it is a, a clearly defined uh, project development process. Six steps. First of all, the Minnesota Dep Department of Commerce will meet with you uh, to review your facilities, to review your, your B3 data, any issues um, that you have with your facilities and, and goals you have as a city or a county or a school district. They'll uh, review your energy savings, your uh, potential greenhouse gas emission reductions, uh, what sort of renewables you're currently using, and what sort of goals you may have around job creation. The department will help you craft a RFP and help you uh, select the energy savings company. 
They will also assist you in uh, performing the investment grade audit uh, to develop the project scope, the cost, the savings, and how it's going to be funded. They'll also be by your side when the, those energy conservation measures are being installed and assist you in ensuring that uh, those energy conservation measures are doing what they're supposed to be doing uh, with measurement and verification reports. So who performs the work? Uh, there are uh, a number of, of uh, ESCOs um, that are a part of GUESS and some very recognizable names here uh, that have been working with cities, counties, and schools for many, many years. The benefits of utilizing GUESS include renewing your infrastructure. You're leveraging short-term payback upgrades to pay for longer-term payback upgrades for deep energy savings, resulting in a healthier, safer, more productive working conditions. It's a complete process from A to Z, from that initial phone call to uh, reviewing your energy usage and reviewing your facilities, all the way through measurement and verification when the project is complete. As I stated a minute ago, you're repurposing dollars versus bonding, levies, or property taxes. It's budget neutral. You already have a, a, a pie chart for utility expenditures. You still have that same size pie chart. Um, it's just using those savings to help pay for the project. And you're accessing private sector expertise in energy efficiency, water conservation, and renewable energy. Additionally, there's less vulnerability to volatile energy prices, weather, and equipment failures. You're making progress in meeting your sustainability goals, and including if you're a city, uh, helping you take that next step for Green Step Cities. There's less taxpayer risk. We're working with pre-qualified companies, companies that have already been vetted, uh, companies that have a lot of expertise in getting these projects done successfully. The state has a master contract uh, with these companies and experts working on your side. Uh, finally, there's a guaranteed, it's right there in the name, the Guaranteed Energy Savings Program. There is a guarantee on the energy savings through ongoing savings, measurement, and verification. If the guarantee is not met, uh, the, cut, the company will cut you a check to make you whole. With that, happy to answer any questions. My contact information is online, and uh, I look forward to speaking with you.